in Malta people are, are historically quite independent and have to make do. It's very much in our nature to be that because there is a lack of resources other than humans and therefore we, we pride ourselves on getting things done in as creative a manner as possible. The history of Melita is one as a pay TV operator. It's one of the oldest cable operators in Europe. Since 2009 when we embarked and invested in a mobile network, uh, we've taken the company in a new direction, pursuing convergence. And a big part of that uh, strategy and that direction is broadband. The customers are interested in buying fixed telephony or internet or TV. Um, probably not even in buying a bundle. He just wants to have one seamless service. And that's how we offer to the consumer nowadays. We introduced Doxa 3 at the end of 2010, beginning of 2011. And with it, we decided that every modem in the household should have Wi-Fi. A world increasingly going to broadband IP-based services. Within the context of that, the seamless Wi-Fi offering essentially allows people to take high broadband speeds from their indoor environments into outdoor environments. The fact that we are the only ones that offer that kind of service already differentiates from our competition. Our modems for our indoor network are from Cisco, our outdoor network is from Cisco, the stuff in between that makes it simple for the customer is from Cisco. We know it all works together. Malta is, is a small place which is very dense. That tends to be good for telecommunications networks in terms of usage. That's the positive side. On the negative side, specifically on wireless, Malta is a limestone rock which is not great for attenuation and getting a wireless signal from point to point or through a wall. The other thing is that Malta really has the ambition to be a smart island and is putting a lot of effort behind that. If you look at the strategy that we're executing from the standpoint of its contribution to the government's e-strategy, we've made progress in getting higher speed consumption across our customer base as well as our market leadership in the broadband space. The first area we did Wi-Fi was Pacheville. That's where the youth go out. There's a lot of restaurants and bar there. Then of course the Slima waterfront because that's in the summer period where the Maltese people go and hang out. Then you have Valletta of course, which is the capital. And there's a lot of government buildings there, but also tourists of course. We now actually have as much Wi-Fi traffic in less than a year than we have 3G after four years or four and a half years. Key to Melita's success in executing a broadband-centered convergent strategy is working with tier one players. Cisco brings a number of benefits to the table. You don't really want to be anybody's guinea pig in this space. If you're in a hurry and you need an army down here, then they can do that. Not everybody can do that. To make something simple is probably one of the harder things to do. Working with Cisco, that was a positive experience at the end of the day, and that they understand that. 